Equity Peaks in the Gap Fill Combo today. This is a strategy that's in TradeStation, Ninja Trader, and Multicharts. You see, yesterday the trade was a short trade, and today it was a long trade. And just taking small trades here, making Equity Peaks. This is part of the seven trading systems for the S&P futures. And this is an open code members area that uh, was from a book released in 2010. So I don't typically share the open code, but I released a book in a members area in 2010. I had an update in 2024, and this will close on May the 1st. So a few more days that you get access to that's a rare opportunity to have open code strategies that we trade. Um, and so it's a unique opportunity that's, that lasts through May the 1st, or closes on May the 1st so just a few more days left of that and that includes the uh, books in the sh the strategies in the books as well as all the 2024 updates that are not in the book and you get this gap fill combo trade station ninja trader multi charts um, another highlighted strategy is the uh, gap continuation strategy let's take a look at that it had um, the most recent trades you can see here it had a few losers back here there was a few losers in a row um, you see those losers and then um, it had a winner and a loser and then a winner recently let's look at the equity curve for this and you can see here where we are on the equity curve what the strategy looks like this also has the open code in the uh, members area so you can see uh, strategies we like to put uh, strategies at different phases of the um, equity curve we like to put strategies that are you know going up going sideways and going down all in a portfolio we don't want to get a long list of strategies that are right at equity peaks because oftentimes strategies at equity peaks start to go through a drawdown and those that are in a drawdown uh, have the opportunity to recover those that are sideways also have the opportunity to start working higher so we put a portfolio of trading systems together taking into consideration a long list of factors including where we are in the drawdown curve we don't want to get um, strategies that have all of these we don't want to get strategies that ha are all in a drawdown we don't want to get strategies that are all sideways and we don't want to get strategies that are all at equity peaks but a combination of those types of equity curves and you can see uh, where this is on the equity curve and so has a long history and we like this strategy and so um, it's one opportunity to trade gap continue on the s p futures there's a different gap continuation in the other uh, book and members area algorithmic trading systems I have and Viper is down today and this one let's look at the latest performance summary for this this is um, a strategy that can be leased it does not include open code there's no book for this this is the his history of this strategy going back to 2018 and you can see it's gone through a drawdown recovery and then on the way to recovery can have micro drawdowns as well and so you can see that here um, on some of the recent trades like today um, depending on which variation you trade this is the um, this is the tighter stop loss version $600 stop loss there's a $1200 stop loss version that's still in this trade and you can see there were good trades on Wednesday short 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 and then the last trade was a loss so you had three winners and one loser on the way to trying to make equity peaks in today uh, there's a loss at the end of the day and a loss today so far on this variation of viper and then v reversal huge day yesterday in v reversal again these strategies are in trade station ninja trader and multi charts and you can see this is a combination of v reversal two and four and so it took the reversal in the morning reversal in the afternoon this is kind of a continuation reversal pattern instead of what you might think of as the market going down and then reversing and then going down again and then reversing again it captured the waves of the reversal so small reversals higher uh, small reversal higher and um, you know it worked its way higher and the market surged at the end of the day and we had some other strategies to capture that move the V reversals had already hit their profit targets but good trades let's look at the performance summary for this setup very similar between the platforms and the as far as the uh, trading system stats let's look at the analysis with the equity peaks in a lot of our portfolios yesterday based on the results of a lot of these strategies so working towards its working towards equity peaks right here I think it did make a new equity peak yesterday based on this chart or close to it and you can see it's sideways 
potentially ready to break out and V reversal combo 24. Those are some of the top strategies yesterday um, that helped us. We had additional V reversals. We had some VSD breakout strategies. And so I wanted to share with you the latest on these strategies. Also, rare opportunity to get the open code for these two strategies, as well as all 2024 updates, as well as the original 2010 strategies and seven trading systems for the uh, S&P futures. The link for this is below this video. So you can, you can uh, take a look at that before the um, before that closes on May the 1st. It will close on May 1st. It's about uh, four or five days away. So that is the update for today as we go into Friday, about an hour before the market closes. Hey, David Bean here. Welcome to Capstone Trading Systems YouTube page. Be sure to subscribe to join our community of algorithmic traders. We are real money traders. We share our winning streaks. We share our losing streaks, as well as market updates, strategies, and coding tips.